So here's what it does when it's plugged in. You get that screen, then you get the Sega logo, and wait for it. Hey, there we go, it comes up. So the menu I've added for this, <laughs> and I'll explain to you in a little bit more detail, just so you're kind of in the loop, mm. um, is I've added um, a set of theater rings, which is another like operating system. Well, kind of more front end to the operating system that's already there, mm -hmm. just to make it pretty. So, oh, hit the wrong button. Yeah, screams at me. Mm -hmm. So what I've got here, I've got um, a couple of folders, obviously European games. I've put in the artwork for the, um, there we go, a better look, of the box for the European stroke, like Australasian version. Um, and then I've got the Japanese box up there as well, which won't come up very well on this phone. But there we go. So they had a beautiful, beautiful white box. Oh. And I'll come back to the Kai in a minute. Got the American box as well, which kind of looks a, bit, a little bit like that. Oh. So, and then I also, because I can, I put Kai on here as well. So the pseudo Saturn Kai, was a little cartridge that you put in the cartridge bay. There's like a cartridge bay on the top of the Sega Saturn mm. for things like extra RAM for games that needed it. Yeah. So oh. Street Fighter Three. Mm. Um, there was also uh, other games that needed just one meg of extra memory. So there's a little switch you can toggle it between mm. four and one. Mm. Um, but the Sudo Saturn Kai, which was the cartridge I bought, also circumvent some of the security so if you create a game and burn it to a cd you can pop the cd in the device and it would boot it as if it's a regular game because it won't know any different and just go okay this is genuine game patched boom load hmm. um but the version i've got on here which is running through um and i'll show you what it looks like in a second um the uh the um, through the through the satiator, uh, will just basically have an argument between those those two things. So what I've done is I've wiped my pseudo satin Kai on the cartridge so I can use the extra RAM. But the other thing that I've done um, is I've got the pseudo satin version of the Kai on here. So. If we jump into it, there we go. Lovely little boot logo. Hmm. So I've, I've added a lot of the um, actual box art and all of that as well, oh, cool. which is pretty easy to do. And I'll show you that in a second. Back to the menu. So one of the reasons why she might be going, oh, well, if you've got all the games on here, why would you, why would you need the Kai still? because it allows you to cheat. Mm. And sometimes this is a benefit. So there is other things that the cheats can enable you to do. So for example, I'm sure you'd absolutely love this game if you've never played on it. Have you played on um, Die Hard Arcade? Uh... I've played the PlayStation version, but ah, okay, well, it's pretty bit. much it's pretty much the same between the two systems. It's not really that much different. But that was like twenty years ago. Well, so I just yeah, barely remember. Barely it. remember. That's because you're old like me. Mm. Um, but the version back in my day. Back in my day, get off my lawn. <laughs> <laughs> the, the the Japanese version is called Dynamite Decker, right? And oh, um, okay. one of the things that you can do on here, if I can get to it because this is the menu, it's going to load, there we go, is because the game itself jumped between different resolutions, you can set it to just run at 240. Mm. So it's not just, you know, cheats, you can enable other features that would normally not be, not be on there. Yeah. But one of the things I'm going to do, this is going to turn with the game now. Yeah, we're going to go this way. So I'm introducing okay. Alex tonight, because he hasn't played this before. He's having a bit of fun, <laughs> trying to work out what he's supposed to do. I like swimming. <laughs> and there's a thing. So they did, um, when this game came out, have a very uh, interesting controller, um, which I do not have, sadly. 
uh, which is called the 3D controller. And it was sort of like a, uh, the easy way to describe it is like a cross between the Xbox controller and a Sega Mega Drive controller. It was round um, and had a fun stick so that you could move uh, knights around a lot easier than trying to use Ooh. a control pad. But we're using the um, the retro bit wireless control pad and the version 2 which doesn't have the 3D, it's just regular control pad. The spinny thing feels yeah, a little bit... Yeah, you're going to run out of time. You need to go back to the temple. Oh, the temple. Yeah, oh, okay. go back to the temple. It's like, go, go in there. Go, 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 go. Yeah. All right, just no, no, head back, head back. Even the time's going to run out. Just stay there. Yeah. It's fine. Stay. Stay. There. Okay. Right, collect, collect the blue things and then head back to where you were. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah, he's gonna wake you up if he catches you. Oh, okay, yeah, gotcha. Yeah. I forgot about so, Oh, you can't, you gotta collect them first. Oh, you gotta go back. I just realized I'm gonna that. Go this away, and this away. Yeah. Yeah. Leave me. <laughs> so this is an interesting game to play. Definitely worth one to try if you get a sixth second. What about start? Press start, yeah. Doesn't matter which bit you select. A or C? Uh, press start. That's it. Search my bad recording, everyone. So, just press start, or? Yeah, you can. This is just a story. So the, the abridged version of this story is, um, there's like the universe's best um, wrestler, and then someone kidnaps the princess I don't fully understand what's going on because I can't obviously understand all of what's going was on he, did he used to be a plumber no he didn't come to fix anything oh uh, okay yeah but I can understand where you're going with Mario that. Luigi no no I'm no? glad that's what you meant because I was wondering where else you were going with that reference oh uh, okay no no yeah 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 yeah, yeah. yeah there, there could have been that it could, it could have been that too, especially when you see what happens in a minute. So hit start again. There you go. There. I died. Yeah, I don't understand that level either, but it's okay. Yeah, this is this is choke. Yeah, you're on the second level. So this is choke. I'm gonna mispronounce it terribly. Choke Niki. This was also out on the um, PlayStation, believe it or not. But it is the weirdest game. Um, I'm not going to show you the boss, but me and Alex are going to have a laugh when the boss actually turns up. <laughs> 